In this latest clip from No Jumper, WAC 100 responds to a message he received from Lil Woody after WAC promoted a flyer about Woody allegedly snitching on Young Thug. WAC, who has been vocal about various street politics, is now shedding light on this situation, and he's got some things to say about how Lil Woody approached him. Before we get into it, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel for all the latest updates on hip-hop, street news, and everything in between. You won't want to miss this. So without further ado, let's play the content and hear what WAC 100 has to say. When you're right. you don't care, it's like it didn't oh, okay. happen. Yeah. They can say whatever they want. But uh, he was, you, you Look, and Woody I do. I promoted his flyer. Well, you have a lot in common. I promoted his flyer, bro. Georgia Streets, go support your star witness. That's his flyer. <laughs> and he responded to that? Yeah, he got mad. He says, you going to make me smack that bald head. I said, you got a bald head too. What's wrong with the promo? Mm. He said, keep, <laughs> keep trolling. <laughs> I said, nigga, you a rat. Live the rat's life. Kill the tough shit, my nigga. And he's crying. He said, laughing. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. I said, I can respect you standing on your shit, but don't get mad about your reality. I got to say, I agree with WAC 100 on this one. You really can't be mad at people for calling you a rat when everyone saw what you did. When it's out there for the world to see, you can't just expect folks to ignore it. Now, Lil Woody has come out saying he was lying in those interrogations to get himself out of trouble. If that's true, it raises the question. Does that still make him a rat? I mean, at the end of the day, even if you're lying to save yourself, you're still putting other people in a bad spot. It's a tricky situation, but in the streets, perception is everything, and that's what people are reacting to. On a positive note, though, Lil Woody seems to be doing well for himself right now, making a lot of money and staying relevant. But I gotta say, I don't think it's smart to be out here promoting that you're everywhere, and no one's touching you because of what you did. It's almost like you're inviting people to test you. Why would you even want that kind of energy around you? Let's keep it real. Sometimes the best move is to stay low and keep handling your business quietly. 